Welcome to World in Days, where today we embark on a captivating four-day journey through Prague, a city of history, beauty, and culinary delights. Join us as we explore its ancient streets, majestic castles, and vibrant culture. Let's dive into the magic of Prague, one day at a time. Our journey in Prague begins at Prague Castle, where the chronicles of kings and emperors unfold within its walls, showcasing the city's rich tapestry of history and architecture. The awe-inspiring Prague Castle, the world's largest ancient castle, stands as a testament to Czech history, embodying centuries of architectural evolution. Its vast complex invites visitors to explore royal palaces, ancient churches, and picturesque gardens, offering a glimpse into the nation's storied past. The highlight is St. Vitus Cathedral, a Gothic architectural masterpiece that dominates the skyline. After exploring the castle, we dine at local, nestled in the castle's vicinity. It's a cozy spot for traditional Czech cuisine, offering a taste of local flavors right after exploring Prague Castle. Just a stone's throw from the castle's main gates, Golden Lane awaits with its colorful facades and historical charm. Once home to the castle's guards and goldsmiths, today it offers a unique peek into the lives of those who lived in the shadows of royalty. Our day concludes at Camper Park, a riverside restaurant offering exquisite cuisine with breathtaking views of the Vltava River and Charles Bridge. We end our day with a stroll through the historical streets of Mala Strana, taking in the Baroque architecture and the serene atmosphere of this ancient part of Prague. Day two takes us to the heart of Prague, exploring the old town's historical marvels and the poignant history of the Jewish quarter. In Prague's old town square, the past comes alive with the hourly show of the astronomical clock, a marvel of medieval engineering. The square is a mosaic of architectural styles, buzzing with the energy of visitors and locals alike. For lunch, we visit Café Franz, a chic spot in the Jewish quarter for a modern take on traditional Jewish dishes, blending history with contemporary flavors. Our afternoon is spent crossing the iconic Charles Bridge, a Gothic masterpiece spanning the Vltava River. Each step on this bridge is a walk through history, with statues of saints watching over the city. Dinner is served at Mlynek. Overlooking the river, Mlynek presents a modern twist on Czech cuisine, pairing culinary art with scenic views. We close our day with a reflective walk along the Vltava River, embracing the peaceful ambience and the illuminated Prague skyline, pondering the timeless beauty of the city. On day three, we venture into the enchanting streets of Mala Strana and the artistic haven of Camper Island, exploring Prague's lesser-known gems. Our morning begins in the serene Wallenstein Garden, a baroque masterpiece hidden away from the bustling city. Its manicured gardens and peacock-studded grounds offer a tranquil escape. Lunch at Café Savoy promises a culinary delight in an opulent setting, where the grandeur of Prague's café culture is on full display, offering a blend of Czech and French gastronomy. In the afternoon, we visit the Lenin Wall, a symbol of freedom and rebellion. This vibrant canvas of graffiti stands as a testament to the city's spirited history and contemporary struggles. Dinner at Umaliru offers an experience steeped in history, where traditional Czech dishes are served in a dining room that has hosted guests for centuries. Our day ends with a stroll on Camper Island, a tranquil pocket of Prague that boasts art installations, quaint cafes and verdant parks, reflecting the city's artistic soul and natural beauty. 
The final day of our journey takes us to the historic Visegrad Fortress and along the bustling Naplavka River Bank, celebrating Prague's vibrant culture and panoramic vistas. Visegrad Fortress, perched atop a hill, offers sweeping views of Prague. It's a place where legends of ancient princes and mythical heroines come to life, surrounded by Gothic ruins and lush gardens. For lunch, we find ourselves at Podolka, where the charm of riverside dining meets the innovation of Czech cuisine, offering a relaxed atmosphere to enjoy the flavors of Prague. Our afternoon is spent wandering the Naplavka River bank, a lively cultural hotspot where the rhythm of the river meets the pulse of the city. Here, art, music, and gastronomy blend seamlessly. We conclude our Prague adventure at Bellevue, dining in elegance with the city's skyline as our backdrop. Our journey ends with a reflective evening walk through Prague's illuminated streets, soaking in the architectural beauty and historical depth of the city, a fitting end to our unforgettable journey with World in Days. The best time to visit Prague is during the spring and early fall, specifically from mid-April through May, and then again from September to mid-October. During these periods, the weather is mild and pleasant, making it ideal for exploring the city's outdoor attractions and historic sites without the discomfort of summer heat or winter chill. Spring brings Prague to life with blooming flowers and green parks, while autumn covers the city in a beautiful palette of fall colors. Both seasons also offer the advantage of fewer tourists compared to the peak summer months, allowing for a more relaxed experience when visiting popular sites like Prague Castle, Charles Bridge, and the Old Town Square. Additionally, these times offer a good balance between enjoyable weather and the availability of cultural events making them perfect for experiencing the city's vibrant atmosphere. However, it's worth noting that Prague has its charms throughout the year, including festive Christmas markets and beautiful winter scenes from late November to early January, though it can be quite cold. Summer, on the other hand, offers warm weather and a plethora of festivals, but expect larger crowds and higher prices. Czech Republic uses the Czech Karuna. While many places accept credit cards, it's wise to carry some cash for smaller shops or local markets. Prague's public transport system is efficient and affordable. Consider buying a 24-hour or three-day pass to easily navigate the city via trams, buses, and the metro. Prague's historic areas are best explored on foot, and its cobblestone streets can be tough on your feet. Wear comfortable shoes for long walking days. The official language is Czech, but English is widely understood in tourist areas. Learning a few basic Czech phrases can enhance your interaction with locals. Like any major city, watch out for pickpockets, especially in crowded areas. Keep your valuables secure and be mindful of your belongings. Tipping is customary in Prague. A 10 to 15% tip in restaurants and for taxi drivers is standard if the service was satisfactory. Incorporating these tips into your Prague visit will help ensure a smooth, enjoyable experience as you explore this historic and vibrant city. And just like that, our four-day journey through the heart-stirring streets of Prague comes to a close. From the commanding presence of Prague Castle to the serene whispers of the Vltava River, each step through this city has been a step through history, culture, and undeniable beauty. Thank you for joining us on this journey with World in Days. Where will our adventures take us next? Subscribe, follow us on our social media channels, and turn on notifications so you never miss an opportunity to explore the world, one city at a time. Until then, keep wondering, 
and keep discovering the stories that make each corner of our world uniquely captivating. Safe travels and see you on our next adventure.